Hello guys, let's see how we can start our computer in safe mode. So there are two methods or there are more than two methods but we will see how we can start in safe mode when you can open your computer and we will also see how you can start your computer in safe mode if you cannot actually open your computer or you cannot boot into your operating system. The first step is pretty simple. We just type msconfig, first press Windows R, you will see this run dialog and then type msconfig and then hit OK. And now you can go to this boot section click on safe mode, safe boot, click minimal alternative shell, active directory repair or network, whichever one you want, and then click apply. So yeah, you, when you see this dialog box, just hit OK, and then hit OK. So now when, when your computer reboots, you will be able to boot in safe mode. So that is the first step. Now let's see how we can boot our PC into safe mode using the second step. So the second step is pretty simple. You just press your Windows button and where it shows power, what you need to do is uh, press, press and hold shift and then click restart. So when you press and hold shift and click restart, your PC will be restarted and you will get an option to start into safe mode. So let's see what happens when we hold shift and click on restart. So I have to on restart and this is what I'm seeing right now. So you'll see a bunch of options. If you continue, you will just boot into normal mode. So you need to click on troubleshoot. This is what you see when you click on troubleshoot. Now click on advanced options. And now you will see this lot of options. So you need to click on startup repair. And this is what you'll see when you click on startup repair. Now you just click restart and you will be able to boot into safe mode. If you have any problems, let me know in the comments below.